again, everybody. Welcome back to The Huddle, the Review.com's weekly high school sports show. I'm Rob Toder, joined as always by Mike Brown, and it's hard to believe, but it's high school football season, ready to go. This Thursday night, a couple of games, and everybody else gets going on Friday night in the Alliance uh, area. And Mike, let's talk uh, briefly about the Alliance Aviators, uh, a pretty veteran ball club, a lot of talent, a lot of speed. And uh, you like them a lot. And they, they will get uh, a test at home Friday night. That's right. I, I, it's going to be our game of the week, the reviews game of the week on Friday night. Should be a great crowd at Mountain Union Stadium. Yeah, Rob, I, I think Alliance is just, they have almost that entire team back from last year. When Alliance won four of its last five games and really came on strongly toward the end of the season. And they have players like Deuce Johnson and Howard Frazier, and it goes on and on and on. That's going to be an explosive offense. That's an offense, I believe, that was averaging 44 points a game last year. And that whole team comes back, so they're going to be dynamite, I think. You, you mentioned uh, how, how well they played the second half mm -hmm. of the season. That, that's just going to give them confidence right. going into building over to this year. I'm Absolutely. Sure. And then with St. Tom, St. Tom, kind of just the opposite. You know, St. Tom dropped down to Division Seven this year, which I think will help their playoff chances. But they lost a lot of the veterans from last year's team. St. Tom, I believe their roster is in the 20s this year, so... That's a team that needs to stay healthy. They play a good schedule, and if they do, being in Division Seven, if St. Tom can can win six or seven games this year with a young team in Division Seven with their schedule, that probably gets them in the playoffs. Okay, so looking ahead to that game Friday mm -hmm. night, and yep. that's at Mount Union Stadium. Right. Obviously, turnovers, penalties, always mm -hmm. a key to the outcome. Yep. What do you see as the outcome, or the key to the outcome for these? For well, these I think teams? for St. Tom, they need to hold Alliance's explosive offense down, which is easier said than done. I think for Alliance. They need, and, and Coach Whiting has said this, they need to improve on the defensive side of the ball. As good as they are offensively, they gave up a lot of points last year. I think it was close to 40 points a game. But those players come back, and hopefully a season of experience is going to help them on that side of the ball. Okay. Well, make sure you check out the Alliance Review. Uh, we'll have previews of this game. Friday we're going to have five things to watch for the, in this mm -hmm. ball game. Mm -hmm. And the Review.com complete coverage of the game, uh, including video and, photo, and a photo gallery. Mm -hmm. So... Uh, and also, make sure you check the review.com throughout the week. We'll have shorter videos this year. We're going to try mm -hmm. something different. Mm -hmm. We're going to have shorter videos, and we're going to talk about each team individually. Yep. So, for Mike Brown, this is Rob Toter. Check us out. We'll talk to you next time.